Slim J is back. Bandanas? provided by the man with the hands of steel, Seth DeLay, the stray cat, Brody Ray Chase, and because I know I will never hear the end of it if I don't actually say this, the best referee in the world, the sexiest referee on the planet, self-proclaimed Mike Posey. Slim P. And I can think of at least, you know, one person that would heavily disagree with that particular assessment. Well, you know what? That one person's opinion doesn't matter. Yeah, and you know what? Let's, let's go ahead and say it. I, I want to hear. I want to hear it come out of your mouth. Set delay, fresh off of victory and hostile environment over Slim J, a victory that, from what Brody Ray Chase and Set Delay have told me and told the world here, has put Slim J out of wrestling forever. He's not coming back. One concussion, too many. Sayonara, see you later, off to the glue factory, my friends. What we saw at Hostile Environment was a brass knuckles on a pole match. Seth, by Delay, Seth Delay versus Slim J. Seth Delay victorious, not without a little assistance, specifically in the form of Mike Posey, who came into the ring as an NWA official and proceeded to use the brass knuckles to further injure Slim J. I would love to say simply to injure him as opposed to simply injure him or simply further injure him. The whole situation just disgusts me beyond words. But Mike Posey, now the legal man, receiving end of that shot from Corey Hollis. This is his anarchy debut. Uh, Mike Posey, Seth DeLay, and the stray cat, Brody Ray Chase, can, oh, good grief, can, at least for now, take credit for putting Slim J on the shelf. Only time will tell how long he is out. The man did suffer a concussion, was still suffering the effects of that concussion when he walked in to hostile environment. He was there against doctor's orders. And look at the strength. Of Mike Posey as he stalls out the vertical suplex, cover two, and only a two count. Well, Greg, I don't you know, in the past, you know, we've talked about Slim J, the injuries, the laundry list of injuries this man has suffered. The time this man has had to take off, only to come back, you know, better than before. Or maybe not better than before, but a little bit stronger for it. 
Will it happen this time? Is he actually gone for good? We haven't even had an update on Slim J since the injury. We still have not heard any word on Slim J beyond what we have been told. Concussion, the grade of that concussion, the after effects of it, we do not know. I give it an A plus. Oh, good Lord. That's not what I meant, and you know it. Right now, the stray cat, Brody Ray Chase, the Great American Scream Machine. That's right. <laughs> the Great American Scream Machine, I say it all the time. The lines may be long, but the ride is even longer. <laughs> and right now, Brody Ray Chase sizing up young Mr. Hollis, right hand. Big knee from the stray cat, cover and hook of the leg, and only a two count, folks. We have got a whole lot of action in store this week on Anarchy, not the least of which we have two big championship matches. The Anarchy Tag Team title on the line, a rematch from Hostile Environment 2009, folks. It will be the former Anarchy Tag Team champions, Derek Driver and Steven Walters, the new wave, taking on the now two-time reigning Anarchy Tag Team Champions, JT Talent, and Drew Pelton III, Talent Money. As right now, Corey Hollis trying his best to fight back with Seth DeLay, a former Tag Team Champion in his own right, brings it back to the corner, makes a tag to Mike Posey. Lung blower, Posey measures him, and Posey with a neck breaker. Also, folks, the National Heavyweight Championship will be on the line as we will see the Universal Soldier shatter the National Heavyweight Champion as he defends that title against the man who ended his reign as Anarchy Heavyweight Champion, the No Pain Train Iceberg. That is later on this week on Anarchy as Corey Hollis showing some athleticism here. Tag in, and here's Alejandro Bravo who walks right in to a drop kick from Mike Posey. Tag in, and here comes the Stray Cat. Probably wishes he wouldn't have tagged into Corey Hollis now. And now, Brody Ray Chase sets his man up. Gut wrench into the power bomb. Cover here, two, and that will do it. Let's go to Michael Gentry for the official word. Ladies and gentlemen, here are your winners. Mike Posey, Seth DeLay, and Brody Ray Chase. And it does not look like these guys are done. They get rid of Kareem Abdul-Jamar. They're just trying to give the people what they paid for. Oh, good Lord. The same here. And now, would you look at this? We've seen this time and again. Brass knucks from the man with the hand to steal. And here comes Bo Newsome with an equalizer of his own. 